Hi there. Item. Undebunking. Subject. A photo showing what looks like a Bigfoot. I mean, it really does. I stared at this thing, thinking that it wasn't someone in a costume. The physique uh, didn't match that of a human. Uh, there were no gatherings of, or folds or hanging loose or baggy material at all. The Reddit post uh, mentioned it was posted on a Facebook page, so off I went with high hopes. Granted, it was only a photograph, but you never know. I grabbed the original photo and ran it through my forensics tool just to see if there was some obvious shenanigans going on. A photoshopped image could reveal itself with just a little tweaking, but it became obvious that there were no anomalies going on with this thing at all. I saw that someone had done a photo enhancement. Not bad. As good as it was, though, I like to go over the same ground just in case, you know, I might find something new or different. Now, my enhancements uh, aren't meant to make the photo look pretty. as uh, to see if I can draw out more detail in the subject creature. And here is where I found something weird. Adding contrast will heighten the shadows, but it looks as if there are no shadows at all on the subject itself. Usually, uh, light will strike a person or animal or whatever, and because we are not flat, you know, our arms, chest, neck, chin, or whatever, will cast shadows and become more evident when contrast is added to it. But this thing doesn't have any of that. So it was a couple of weeks ago uh, that I started in with image searches and so forth and came up with the following. About eight years ago, near Wilkesboro, North Carolina, a similar sighting report was made. The sighting took place in the same area this later photo was taken along Highway 18 between Wilkesboro and Lenoir. A local paper, News Topic of Lenoir, sent one of their reporters, Kim Gilliland, to investigate the story. With him was photographer David Pruitt. They spoke to the property owner about the sightings and got quite a laugh out of him. As it turns out, the man liked to make large plywood cutouts and stick them around his property to amuse passerbys. One is a very large bull moose, and the other is this cutout of a Bigfoot. Well, thanks for watching.